It is. You know, uh, one of my mentors at one, po- at one point said he's not afraid to pay tax because he knows he made money. But let's pretend you're in the majority that doesn't like to pay tax. Um, there's a few different things you can do, but the main one is doing uh, what we call a 1031 deferred tax exchange. Uh, you have to be selling like property and buying like property. So um, what somebody could do, let's say they have 10 rental properties, five rental properties, whatever it is, uh, you can sell those houses and you put it in this 1031 program and then you you have to sell them by a certain time, uh, identify the next property or properties and then make those purchases within a certain time frame. So let's say you sell 10 uh, you buy, you know, it's kind of like Monopoly. You know, sell the green, you buy the red. So you could buy a bigger apartment building, roll that tax, you know, the tax burden into there. Or uh, what some people do if they're closer to retirement, they might sell those rental properties, go buy a lake home. Uh, they rent it maybe one or two weeks out of the year. It's a rental property at that point. So it's a like kind, okay. And, you know, maybe you're losing money on it. There's tax benefits there you can talk to your CPA about. Bottom line is 1031, you can roll it into the next property, Uh, don't pay tax, pretty good deal.